supporters. I think these sailors are out here. There's been um, we've had to walk past them during the day, and um, it wasn't an easy job for anybody trying to get past them. Now look, they're going to chase them off. Look at this. There's something uh, going on here with players boy. and spectators. You're There's silly a, boy. an argument here. This is silly stuff. This is not good. Lily's involved there too. There are three players in this. And there's been a punch thrown, there are policemen on the field, but a spectator punched one of the Australian players. And that is a, a sensation here. One of the spectators, I know they're English people, they're English migrants, a policeman is making an arrest there. And that's uh, Alderman, is it? He's down. Well, he is the first man to do the chasing, and he came off second best. But uh, surely the police, it's the job for the police, not the players. The players are to play cricket, and cricket alone, and the police are there for protection. Now, we'll show you the instant what happened, and here it is. Now, watch the man coming through with a blue cat. Now, watch him, that's Alderman, and he hits him as he goes through. Now, we'll just take it from here. Now, Alderman is retaliating. We're chasing him. He grabs him here. He goes down. Two other Australian players come in. Now, something happened here. Now, Alderman at that stage is quite okay. Now, here's looking at this again from another angle. And there's a, it looked to be a punch going in there as other players come, the other Australian players come in. Yes, oh, look, this is a policeman on the ground. Well, well, isn't it disgusting? It's disgusting, this. There's no other way to describe it. And there's Alderman being carried off the field in a stretcher, and the players have left the field, and play has been stopped by the umpires. That's the section of the crowd right over in front of the grandstand. That's the person who was involved, being led off in handcuffs by the police. And there's Terry Alderman. It looks like he has some form of arm injury. He may have fractured an arm there. If the way, the way that his arm is being held up, he may have suffered a, an injury of that type or a collarbone. Something's happened to him there. He's well, have a look at the boys there. They're being shown the way out, and rightly so. I sincerely hope they don't return to the game.